One of the most critical programs for the Spanish defense and industry, the Naventia S-80 Plus submarine is going through a decisive moment given the imminent sea trials of the first unit, the Isaac Peril, and progress in the construction of the other three units, especially the second, the Narciso Monturial. The S-80 Plus program follows a regulated system engineering process. It is necessary to pass a series of technical or quality reviews in which it must demonstrate that the submarine is mature to move on the next phase. Engine startup is the fourth safety milestone after power up, battery loading and launching. The S-80 Plus has engines equipped with the DAR system that is diesel alternator rectifiers which allow the charging of the batteries or directly supply energy to the main electric motor. The diesel engines are manufactured by the Naventia Motors factory under license from German company MTU. In the coming months, the S81 will undergo the first battery charges with the DAR and the test on moorings before the sea trials. In addition, in the dock, workers continue to complete the installation work of the sensors, the eyes and ears of the submarine. The submarine periscope has been replaced with an optronic mast which provides more information about location and dimension compared to the conventional periscopes. The snorkel is a much improved Dutch design from the World War II era which allows more air intake for the operation of diesel engines at periscope depth. The initial objective is to deliver the S-81 to the Spanish Navy in the first quarter of 2023. A lot of work remains in 2022 in which the critical sea trials will be carried out, scheduled for the beginning of this year. In addition to this milestone, Naventia is also working hard on the other three submarines that make up the class which are the Narciso Monturial S-82, the Cosme Garcia S-83 and the Matteo Garcia de Los Reyes S84 with approximate delivery date in 2024, 26 and 2028. The Air Independent Propulsion Module, which allows the submarine to transit for up to three weeks without taking oxygen from the outside, will be installed in S-83 and later in all three submarines. Now, the S-80's Air Independent Propulsion System is based on a bioethanol processor consisting of a reaction chamber and several intermediate Coprox reactors. The system is supplied by Abengoa's Heine Green and transforms bioethanol into high purity hydrogen the output feeds a series of fuel cells from the company utc power Naventia's current main objective is to win the tender from the indian navy called p75i through which it will equip itself with six submarines with AIP. The Spanish company is one of the five companies shortlisted to win the contract, along with rivals such as Naval Group, France Scorpion, Tyson Krupp Marine Systems, TKMS Germany Type 214, Rubin, Russia Armor 1650, and Daewoo Shipbuilding and Marine Engineering DSME from South Korea.